Hey guys, welcome back. So today's video is gonna be super fun because today I'm going to be cleaning and decorating my car for summer. I did this last year for Halloween and I absolutely loved it. I cleaned the car and then I decorated it with a bunch of like cute Halloween decorations and it made me so freaking happy. So I thought, why not do this for summertime? Why not make this a little bit of a tradition? So since summer is right around the corner, I thought that this would be the perfect time to clean and decorate my car. So I picked up a couple things that I'm super, super excited to unbox and decorate with you. But first things first, this car needs a deep cleaning. We took a trip to Redlands last week with all three of our dogs, so needless to say, this car is a mess. Um, that black tarp that we have hanging over the seats is a seat cover for the dogs when we are, whenever we take them on trips with us. Um, we still have their dog beds in here. Like, the dashboard is dusty and in need of some cleaning. The floors need vacuuming. Like, we need the whole works, okay? We need all the details done today. So let me show you what we're working with. So the dashboard is all kinds of dusty, crusty, and musty. We have the seats and trash in the cup holders again. Dog bed from our trip. Another dog bed, a towel, my boyfriend's hat, dog leash, a hanger, the dog seat cover that I was telling you about, which is filled with dirt, which is not not great. The outside of the car is actually not that dirty because we actually took it to get washed um, last week. So it's not bad. I think we have our work cut out for us. Let's get started. This was all the stuff that we had back there. Two dog beds, some bags, blanket, a towel, some sandals, a cake stand, like what? <laughs> all right, what are you doing? I'm gonna restore these headlights. Ooh. Stop. Here's where things get wild. Bringing out this vacuum. Heavy duty stuff right here. Let's get her done. When he changes your windshield wiper fluid. Ooh. Hello again. So it is the next day. We got everything done around like noonish, I want to say, and we stopped because it got way too hot. This is supposed to be the hottest week of the month, so it was a really bad decision to do this video this week, but um, it's fine. We survived. The car got thoroughly cleaned. We wiped everything down. I vacuumed the seats, the carpet. Um, I took down all the junk, all the trash. My boyfriend buffed out the headlights as I showed. He also changed my windshield washer fluid or whatever it's called. And now the car is spotless. I'm so happy with it. It looks beautiful. I feel like it's a, a brand new car. Now it's time to deck this baby out, okay? I have some stuff that I picked up online that I'm so excited to see what's gonna happen. So let's start with the most basic thing that I picked up. Obviously, since the car is looking fresh, I want it to smell fresh as well. So I picked up this Yankee Candle in the scent Pink Sands because it screamed summer to me and also it's pink and I love pink and also it smells amazing. It smells so good and it's a clip for like your air vent so you just clip it on. Ooh. Ooh, that smells so good. And I'm just gonna place it on this little side vent right here. <sighs> Perfect. And I can still move the vent whichever way I like. So cute. So the next thing that I got is something that I'm really excited about because it's a crystal. I got a crystal so that I can hang it in my car right here on my rear view mirror. I haven't opened it yet, but I'm so excited. So I picked this up because I am obsessed with crystals and I heard that specific crystals are good to keep in your car to protect you from anything, any car accidents or whatever while you're traveling and it'll keep you safe. So I picked this one up. It's an amethyst crystal and I'm really excited to see how it looks. First of all, this wooden detail in this string is so freaking cute. Let's see, crystal unveiling. Oh my god, that's so cute. I love it. Let me 
might hang it up. Oh my gosh, look at her. <laughs> I love it, it's so cute. This is definitely the type of decoration that I needed in my car to like personalize it because I haven't done really anything to personalize my car or customize it in any way and this definitely makes me happy. So I have two more items to show you. The next thing I got, I wanted to make sure that I got something that was practical, something that I actually could use and that I needed, you know, not like a luxury like this or like decoration, something that was useful. Like it had a purpose. Like this has a purpose, but you know what I mean? Like, you know what I mean? So anyway, I picked up these little like behind the seat um car hangers so that you can hang your bags on the back of the seat because all the time every time we go on trips or whatever i'm always having to carry all these things and having my backpack or my purse on me is so like it's just one extra thing that to have on me that i don't want to deal with and also when we travel and we have like tote bags or whatever i'd like to have them securely and organized on the back seat of the car so that everything is neat and organized and like everything has a designated purpose you know um so i thought that this would help the reviews were great it was super cheap it was like five bucks and it comes with four of them so it's super simple you just hook this onto the back of the chair headrest like that and there you have it you just set your bag on a little hook and you're good to go look at that what the heck so simple i love it the last thing that i got is something that i have been wanting in my car for so long now i saw my friend have these like really freaking cool led lights on the bottom of her car so i picked up these like car interior lights i'm so freaking excited like you guys i've wanted these for so long so shout out to becca the home girl okay for putting me on because <laughs> i've wanted these for so long and if you saw my last video where i decorated my car for halloween i was so stoked to have the little fairy lights in the back of my car like i was in love i loved it i was living my best life so i think this will have the same effect but like times a hundred so first we got to check if the lights work by plugging in by plugging it into the usb connector damn they work they are bright. So like an hour has passed, but we finally finished installing the lights. I thought it'd be like way easier than it was, but it really wasn't. So here it is. Here's the final reveal. So it comes with this little USB cord that you just plug in. And it also comes with an app that you can control the lights with from your phone. So let me turn off the lights to give you the full effect. It's so freaking cool. I can change the colors and it also syncs up to music. I haven't figured out how to do that yet, but that's definitely next on my list. But that's such a super cool feature. You can change it to any color that you like. And also, so this isn't just in the front seat. I got it installed in the back seat too. That way it's always a party in the front and in the back. Ins, 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 ins. <laughs> So that's it for this week's video. I hope that you enjoyed it as much as I did. I had so much fun doing this. This honestly has to become a bit of a tradition for me every season because I love decorating my car. It gives me serotonin that I need. Comment down below to let me know which car accessory was your favorite. I think mine... It's, it's a tough tie between the crystal and the lights. I'm not sure yet. If you like this video, please make sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe down below for new videos every single week. As always, I love you guys very much and I will see you on the next one. Bye! Perfect.